Hello Fox, and this is Kiki, uh, doing a just a trial run of Super Marissa World version 1.5. And uh, I know that there's a replay feature on it, and I don't know how to convert it yet. Um, but anyway, I figured I would just kind of show it off. Uh, Marissa wasn't chosen by anybody from the Tao Hao Mon uh, starter list. Uh, so just to bring some fan base and support for Marissa here, I figure I'll go ahead and just do a quick little one shot of Super Marissa World. Anyway, uh, pretty much this compared to Super Marissa Land, the uh, she has a lot more momentum this time, and she can actually kill you kill you by going warp speed. And uh, the game does reward you for going different routes and whatnot. Like here, uh, you could either just fly over or you can go down that way. And I haven't mastered everything in this game yet. And like I said, uh, this won't be a full LP or nothing. This is just a little short show of it. I normally play this when my... Uh, videos are uploading and I still haven't gotten very far in it but I'll show you what I've got so far anyway uh, for any Tao Hao people who speak uh, kanji or whatever go ahead and translate this for me because I have no idea what you're saying uh, but supposedly uh, Princess, uh, I can't remember who the princess was in this one, but anyway, uh, I think that's Alice in a Yoshi suit or something. <laughs> and uh, I, mean, I could be wrong there, and somebody please feel free to correct me. But uh, basically, it just says, Welcome to Super Mario World, and there you go. <laughs> but what we're just going to go through with this video is just the first three levels, really quick. Uh, so it's showing that you can't go to the other levels yet until you've unlocked some secret exits, which none of them will be shown on this video because I uh, figured that just the first three levels would work. Uh, if anybody wants to explain how to convert the uh, replays to uh, AVI or whatnot, I'll be happy to. Uh, do that. But until then, like I said, it's just going to be the standard of the norm. And yes, I know Tao Hao has uh, music in it. Unfortunately, the music files aren't included with the uh, program, so I can't upload those with the video unless I do it replays. And ow, I hurt. Not sure really what the stars are for, other than getting a high score or something, and you're playing by yourself, so I don't see the point of trying to get a high score of yourself, but eh, I reflect about it, I suppose. I'm going to go ahead and run around like a nutball here and get him. As you can see, it's a lot faster pace uh, than Super Marissa Land, and uh, as you can see, I'm going warp speed here, unlike the Army Man videos. Uh, this is kind of like another second test to see if playing in windowed mode might help my options on a recording, and it seems like the smaller window size is helping. So. Uh, I could try it again for the Army Man LPs. And there we go. And I'm not sure who it is that it was uh, looking like Toad. I, I, uh, not too familiar with all of the characters, so uh, you have to bear with me there. Uh, And here we are already at the level two. This one's pretty much a you have to complete each section in under ten seconds. Uh, 
there is one section that's rather hard, but they do give you waypoints for each one. I guess it's just to introduce the uh, green blocks to let you know about them or something. And the little, uh, little magic seals things are uh, waypoint markers. I'm not going to go for all the stars here. Uh, I'm not 100% good at this game, and I said I don't see much point in it. And now we're at the hard one. <laughs> I really hate this one. Uh, and I'll show you why. This is what to do with uh, Marissa's momentum, as you can see here. Uh, sometimes her momentum will carry her through the jump high enough, and sometimes it won't. Luckily, there isn't a pipe in case you mess up so you can do it again. But uh, I can sometimes her, mo her momentum flies you too high, and then sometimes it'll stop you abruptly short, and then you get a face full of spike. But, uh, yeah, like I said, it's not terribly too long, and I figured I'd just show it off. Well, at least we got that star. Okay, let's keep trying this again. At least they give you like five or six lives each time to, each time you enter a level, so it's nothing too bad. Unfortunately, I don't know how you stop in air. Um, and that's the only reason you'll see me die in one of the later levels is because I don't know how to stop the spin attack once it gets going. And I have no other idea of how it works. And now they're going to pipe maze on us. Uh, pretty much there's, I think, is five or six uh, of the original set. And as long as you just kind of remember where you go, you're fine. Uh, this actually did take me quite a few attempts uh, when I first played the game. But I did figure it out eventually. Also, be careful here, and to death if you miss. Luckily, they do try to give you a hint on where to uh, do your thing. Anyway, there's number five. And it looks like we popped into number two again, so let's go ahead and go back to where we were. And we'll go ahead and get this set, too, while we're at it. Just cause. And we'll go ahead and get these stars. Well, let's check this pipe first. Yeah, no, here's the number three pipe. Oh, that's good. We got that one. And here's the remains of the number five pipe. So let's go ahead and pick them up. Okay. And now we're back to number two. So let's go ahead and continue where we left off. And you see, there's a chain chomp. <laughs> kind of cute, isn't it? The fuzzy monster chain chomp. And then there's these big giant fuzzies. <laughs> oh, there's even the little weedles. So, uh, or however you want to call them. Crawlers, or however you want to call them. And there's flamethrower guys, of course. And uh, I don't know how to stop, so I'm not going to bother with those stars. And uh, this will be it for the... Uh, let's just uh, quick and do a quick shot of Super Marissa World version 1.5. Uh, so, uh, later. Once I get to here... Okay, yep, now later. Uh, see ya.